Well, here we are with the principal of St Columbans College. Couldn't have been a prouder day for you and Reb Getz. How are you? Oh, it's such an exciting day, Scott, to have everyone here. And there are literally hundreds here. There is. So. Um, the car park's definitely full, even the, the back car park's full. Uh, so there's lots of families coming and seeing what the college has on showcase today. Um, can you, for our viewers, can you just walk us through what today is all about? It, it really is saying come and have a look at St Columbans and what we do here and what is our life about in our community. So you come in and you see all the sporting activities. So we're playing Canterbury College today because we're in TAS Sport. Uh, so And that goes on every Saturday. So that actually has impressed everyone because there are hundreds of people involved just in the sport. Yeah. And then you go through the school and you're seeing the school in action that the learning is actually real learning because it's so hands-on and you're seeing from your English department your maths your science the science laboratory are, are full and our new science laboratory is fantastic yeah. um, to our hairdressing salon our hos hospitality everywhere the music and the dance makes it all come alive from the heart so yeah. thank what, you Scott. What I love mm. Anne is you're like a proud mum today. Oh <laughs> absolutely in um, fact someone probably called me mum I think. Yeah. <laughs> um, and um, we had the opportunity to catch up briefly through the week but uh, just for the viewers today as part of our open day showcase can we just elaborate quickly on some of those vocational programs and and extra school activity that you're that you're um, promoting mm -hmm. here at the college? Well we we promote the concept that academic studies and vocational competence go hand in hand. So I, I want to make that clear that we have absolutely high expectations around our academic results but our vocational is going to give our students the cutting edge yeah. in terms of the future and we're very much about the future which needs skills in creativity, in enterprise and innovation. So. Um, in our vocational courses we have 17 certificates ranging from business, hairdressing, hospitality, childcare, um, Christian ministry. So the, the range of certificates um, is massive. We have over 100 students doing school-based traineeships in the areas of IT, fitness, um, administration, hospitality. So. Um, it, whatever you are interested in, you'll find your niche. And that complements all of our more academic subjects, which every subject is approaches learning from hands-on. So we try to get our students engaged, yeah. because if they're engaged, they'll want to be here. Yeah, definitely. Mm. And Anne, I, I love your new slogan, every student, every success, um, certainly is, is the culture of St Columbans. It is. Um, we're an Edmund Rice Associate School, so we strongly believe in the importance of every student. Um, every student means it doesn't matter if the student is has a particular gift in mathematics or a gift in carpentry. We look to try and make it so that that student feels successful and is successful and that everyone leaving this school has something to go to that's going to be fulfilling and develop their potential. Okay. Anne Reb Getz, the principal of St Columbans College Caboolture, thanks for opening your school today um, and hopefully the community will see this and future families will want to attend St Columbans. We hope they do because yeah. we love to have them. Thank right. you, Scott. Hi, girls. What do you love about St Columbans? Um, just all the people and like all my friends. There's so many awesome people you can meet here. All the teachers are like just lovely. Okay. Yeah. And all the subjects you, you've got. Plenty I love of subjects. all the subjects. Yeah, it's all what I wanted to do. So I'm we happy. We have so many it. opportunities here at the college, and it's just really good yeah. to have all these options for our future. What do you guys love about being a student at St Columbans? I love the subjects we have here. Yeah. yeah. And um, yeah. Um, I like the teachers, and all the students are very lovely here. Yeah. Um, do you guys live locally? Uh, we live near Ningi. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and you get the bus to school? Yeah. Yeah, cool. All right. And um, you love being part of St Columbans? Yeah. One of our teachers at St Columbans, how are you going? Hi, how are you going? I'm Tammy. I'm um, new to this school this year, so it's all a little bit exciting. First open day, um, I'm doing English and religion, and um, looking forward to the next few years and um, building my relationships here and, um, and getting involved even more so in the community. Here we are with the Malloy House mascot, uh, Crocodile. How are you going? He hasn't got much to say, but you're having a good day at the Open Day 2014? 
Uh, here with Mike Connolly, assistant, assistant principal of St Columbans. How are you going, Mike? Oh, good, Scott. Great day to be out here at St Columbans. Um, it's great to see all these people coming and seeing what we're offering here at Caboolture. Yeah, you know? um, Mike, I've got to compliment you. The students that are getting around the Open Day today, um, world-class uh, students that you're producing oh. through the college here. Oh, the students here are fantastic. You know, they're very community-minded, you know, involved yeah, wide, uh, widely through the community. Love to, love to be at school and love learning. Yeah, um, lots of sports happening as well. Today. Oh yes, yes Scott, we have very very talented sports people here at St Columbans. I think this year we've got three or four kids that are actually representing nationally. Wow. Probably about 20 or 30 that would be representing Queensland and there's many, many would represent on a, a regional level, yeah. which is great. Um, you have the open day here today, Mike, for the college where families looking to bring their uh, future children to the college. Yes. Um, there's displays through different um, subjects. And yeah, look, all, all, our, all our academic displays, are like the, the science lab which is our new lab that we just built is yeah. is state of the art and um, there's uh, there's lots happening in science and then through our maths and English it's fantastic yeah. I mean you can go down to the hairdressing get yeah. your hair cut or a shampoo okay. if you wanted and, yeah. and through our hospitality it's and, and we've seen some dancing oh and the dancing happening over here and the cultural and performing arts is just yeah. just fantastic we have such talented kids yeah. oh, my congratulations yeah. um, Thanks, a, a great yeah. college uh, in our yeah. in our Caboolture community and let's yeah. hope uh, lots of future families send their kids here as well good on you Scott, thank you for being here today. Here we are, some more teachers and students of St Columbans. How are you going? Good, thanks. Is that your name? My name's Sue Mab, and I'm a maths teacher, but I'm also Jewig House coordinator. So go Jewig House, Red. <laughs> and this happens to be one of my maths students over here, Ehab. Ehab, how are you going, mate? Good, good. You yourself? Yeah, good. Um, you're very proud to be a St Columbans student. Yeah, 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 yeah sure. I'm also proud to be in Malloy House Malloy. as well, because um, being Malloy House coordinator. One of our, our budding students up and running for uh, some good house spirit. Lovely. Yes. And Ehab, you're on the you're on the union team, mate. Yeah, rugby union team. You yep. Played this morning. Yep, we won. Have a win. Yep. All right, go Columbians. Uh, Ian, you're the drama teacher. Here. I am, yes, one of them. Yep. Let's talk about um, drama and performance. It's a great facility. At the yeah, school. good facility. We're actually getting a new building built for film and drama as well. So that's something that's coming in in the next couple of months. Right. And um, yeah. Good cultural atmosphere as well for that to sort of blossom. Might be able to create some future TV stars. Definitely. Here we go at St Clement's Open Day 2014. We have four houses. O'Driscoll, English, Malloy, Jewig. After one, two, three, let's hear the war cry for St Columbans. One, two, three. A couple of year 12 St Columban students, Jake and Savannah, how are you going guys? Oh, we're really yeah. good, thanks. Yeah. Now, now Jake off camera, he said he's got 150 days left to school. Um, what have you enjoyed over the last few years of being a student at St Columban's, mate? Uh, just the opportunities to excel in areas that I'd like to, so yeah. business and stuff. Business? Yeah, yeah, business. And what are you going to do next year, mate, uni? Yeah, uni, Bachelor of Business, majoring in finance. Oh, well done. And Savannah, you've enjoyed being a student at St Columban's? Yeah, I enjoy all the opportunities I've had with my hospitality courses and my hairdressing courses with the trade training centres being here. Yeah, excellent. Uh, so what's your future, Savannah? Uh, I hopefully want to become a counsellor, a student counsellor, okay. and I do youth ministry, so hopefully that'll help me along the way on my pathway to becoming a counsellor. Uh, well done. Uh, congratulations. All the best for the Year 12 exams uh, coming up very shortly, and uh, we wish you all the well for the future. Thank, Thank you. you. Some more students here from St Columbans, uh, Liam, Andrew and Joseph. Liam, what do you like about being a student at St Columbans? Oh, just the people, you know, everyone here is just great, great teachers, great facilities, you know, every, every day is just fun to come to school. Excellent, mate. And, and you, you do like learning academics? Uh, yeah. For a couple De of years ago? Yeah. Well done, mate. And uh, Andrew, what do you like about the college? I like how all we get all the opportunities that we get and we get all the friends that we meet and it's a great learning system and yeah, yeah it's a great school and teachers, so, yeah. Grade 10, mate, another couple of years of studying to go? Yeah. And, and where, where do you think you'll be in the future, Andrew? Somewhere to do with the law, I hope. Hoping that, yeah. Okay. yeah. And uh, and Joseph, how are you going, mate? Grade 9 student? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm enjoying it heaps. Yeah. And, like uh, Andrew said, I just like the opportunity opportunities you get here. Yeah. And you're one of our tour guides this morning, so you're taking uh, parents around the school, showing them everything yeah. it's got? Yeah. yeah. 
Here we are with one of our sporting uh, students at St Columbans. Ella, how are you going? Good, thank you. Um, Ella, tell us the uh, sports that you're involved with here at St Columbans. Um, I'm involved with their touch excellence program and netball program and athletics. And um, you've represented uh, the area in other sports nationally, internationally? Um, yeah, athletics and touch football. Okay. And um, I saw you last night, you were a finalist at the Longman Awards in our region for your sports um, abilities, so how was that? Yeah, oh, it was really fun and it was a great honour to be a finalist. Okay. Um, tell us um, about sporting at St Columbans. There's always uh, plenty for people to be involved in. Um, yeah, there's plenty of programs and lots of opportunities to like, build on your sport. And here we are, the champion mascot of St Columbans College. How are you going, mate? <laughs> Having a good day at the Open Day? Lots to see? Okay, seriously now, Katie, you're one of the students here, college captain of St Columbans for 2014. How are you going? I'm going excellent. And today's a great opportunity to showcase the school? Yeah, it's a really great opportunity. I'm just happy to be here showing everyone how great the school is. Uh, excellent. Darren Grimway, our local state member for Parliament. How are you going, Darren? Yeah, look, it's fantastic. I'm going really well, thank you. And uh, to be a part of this Open Day at one of our local colleges, um, so much on offer for the future students. Yeah, look, I'm, I'm really happy that I got invited to come along and, and meet some of the students and, and some of the teachers here that do amazing things too and the opportunities that I've seen today particularly in around the drama, performing arts, the sports that's happening out in the ovals and the new science lab and those sort of things is just an amazing uh, opportunity for the kids around the area. And uh, without saying corny, uh, corny, investing in the kids future mate? Yeah look we are investing in the kids future and I just visited the, um, the new science lab up here that the state government's chipped in two million dollars to and you know the facilities they've got I said to, to Anne the principal here you know if we had the facilities that these kids have got when I was at school it would have been amazing so it's great to see. I reckon I'm your vintage Darren and uh, it was the old Bunsen burner for me with a few tricks while the teacher wasn't looking but I'm sure that doesn't happen these days. No well it seems to be that they're very professional now and in fact they've got a lot more hands-on stuff and experiments where things are blowing up and all that sort of stuff so I'm sure the kids really like coming to their science classes these days and taking part. Uh, excellent. Uh, from our team mascot uh, for the school have a great day mate we love your work and uh, thanks for joining us. No worries.